Greetings. You have landed at Words Mood Poetry. I am Ruby Body coming to you from a small neighborhood park. Came here today because of the water, the spout. You will know that most people who subscribe to indigenous religions um, have a special affinity to water when they feel grateful and today I am feeling grateful grateful to you my subscribers for sticking with me through this period of my work this season of my work and I was not able as a result to come to you in this way but you have been looking at the videos we've been posting the poetry videos and I am so grateful to you for sticking with me I thank you so so very very much and I am also feeling grateful because this tax season has been a most difficult one with all the changes and now that I'm on the final leg towards the end of the season I can breathe again I feel that my creativity is coming into its own again and I'm beginning to look forward to pivoting to something that is a little different from the poetry this is the main message that I wish to bring to you today. You will see that I am not using a script or notes. I'm just talking to you heart to heart. The main message is to let you know to look out for our short storytelling. Who can refuse a juicy short story in the spring and the summer? And that is what we plan to bring you over the next couple of months some nice short stories with a moral to them. The first will be read by Patrick Thompson. It's called Real Revolutionaries. And we are preparing to bring that one to you soon. So please look out for that, our short stories with a moral. Also, I'm throwing out an invitation to you. Anyone who wishes to read one of the short stories, just put a, a comment in at the bottom let me know how to reach you and you can be a reader for one of the short stories I'm really excited about that just opening up this um, creative window to anyone who wishes to participate young old in between we all are creative beings on that note I want to share a small story with you um, those of you enjoy music would know the album songs in the key of life and that um, that album came to my mind this morning when because of the my waning my fading vision because of looking at the, the computer screen over this last few months these last three months I accidentally I thought had my pencil sharpener upside down and there I was uh, sharpening my pencil and I had no clue that all the shavings were just falling wherever they wished you know and I'm there sharpening normally I am so careful I try to catch all the shavings so that I wouldn't have a difficult cleanup but today I was there shaving not knowing that the shavings were all over the place and it's only when I finished and I had the most beautiful pencil tip I realized that there were the beautiful shavings watching me from my my sink and I thought wow sometimes in life it pays to be not so careful it pays to be like a child just to go with the flow, let the shavings fall where they may, and learn your lesson from that. So with that little lesson, that little life lesson, that little lesson in the key of life, I leave you and I wish you happy Sunday. Look out for the short storytelling. Bye-bye now. Peace out. Thank you so much. It's a wrap. Please, I'm being prompted to say like and subscribe. <laughs> that is how 
free-flowing this video is like and subscribe we appreciate you thank you so much bye now peace out